Have you ever felt excited by the prospect of exploring one of the world's oldest cities? A city that's overflowing with iconic landmarks and hidden gems. Are you wondering how to make the most of your vacation and deeply immerse yourself in the rich culture of Beijing, China? Don't worry, we've got you covered. Today, we're embarking on a journey into the very heart of this captivating civilization. We'll be your guide, taking you through the must, visit spots, and the lesser known secrets of Beijing. Our aim? To ensure that when you step into Beijing, you're fully equipped and excited for your adventure. Welcome back to Town Travel Tips. If you're ready to transform your Beijing travel concerns into a well-orchestrated, immersive experience, please give this video a like, consider subscribing, and together, let's discover the marvels of the Chinese capital. To begin, we'll focus on the places you shouldn't miss when visiting Beijing. We recommend spending at least four nights here. After all, one of the world's ancient cities deserves an depth exploration. First up, the Great Wall of China. Our first destination in Beijing is none other than the Great Wall of China, a symbol recognized worldwide. Two sections stand out for visitors, Mutainyu and Badalang. Mutainyu, having been fully restored, boasts watchtowers that offer breathtaking views of lush landscapes. Badalang, closer to Beijing, attracts more visitors due to its gentler slopes. Both provide a window into China's ancient military defense, and as you walk along the wall, you'll feel as if you've traveled back through the annals of time. Next on the itinerary is the Forbidden City, located at the very heart of Beijing. This majestic palace complex, which also goes by the name Palace Museum, served as the residence for Chinese emperors spanning over half a millennium. Dominated by towering red walls, shimmering golden roofs, and intricate courtyards and halls, it stands as a testament to traditional Chinese architectural grandeur. As you meander through the vast premises, you're transported into a world of opulence and enigma, reminiscent of imperial days gone by. Continuing our exploration, we arrive at the Temple of Heaven. This architectural gem showcases breathtaking symmetry. In bygone eras, emperors from the Ming and Qing dynasties performed sacrifices here, seeking the heavens' blessings for bountiful harvests. The centerpiece, the Hall of Prayer for Good Harvests is a tri-gabled circular wooden edifice. It majestically rises from a triple-tiered marble base, symbolizing the bond between the heavens and our world. Our next stop is the iconic Tiananmen Square, renowned as the world's most expansive city square. It's a tapestry of history and political relevance. Encircling the square, you'll find landmarks like the Tiananmen Tower, the Great Hall of the People, and the Mayo Zedong Memorial Hall. The square has borne witness to pivotal moments in Chinese history. A visit here promises insights into China's intricate past and its evolving present. Lastly, we invite you to unwind with a serene walk through the Summer Palace. A mosaic of lakes, verdant gardens, and regal palaces, it offers a peaceful retreat from the city's hustle. The Summer Palace, once an imperial sanctuary epitomizes the finesse of Chinese landscape gardening. Key attractions here include the Long Corridor, adorned with over 14,000 traditional Chinese artworks, and the exquisite marble boat. This intricately carved pavilion graces the west bank of Cumming Lake, offering a serene haven amid the city's bustling ambiance. But what if you have a few more nights to spare in Beijing? or are revisiting and eager for novel experiences. Beijing is not just about its renowned landmarks. It also shelters a myriad of hidden treasures. These lesser explored spots paint a vivid picture of the city's rich past, dynamic culture, and the rhythm of its daily life. These undiscovered wonders range from historic lanes, buzzing art zones, and important archeological sites to serene temples and peaceful parks. They promise a genuine immersion, letting you weave through the intricate cultural fabric of Beijing. So, are you prepared to venture beyond the well-trodden paths and unravel Beijing's secrets? Ready to explore Beijing from a fresh perspective? Let's dive into these hidden treasures that await off the beaten track. 
First up, the Hutongs. These narrow lanes transport you to the heart of Beijing's everyday life and its rich tapestry of history. As you meander through these winding streets, you'll encounter traditional courtyard dwellings, quaint temples, lively markets, and charming tea houses. For a unique experience, hop onto a rickshaw and let it whisk you through the Hutong maze. Shifting from the traditional to the contemporary, we venture to the 798 Art District. Once an industrial complex, this area has transformed into a hub for modern art. It's peppered with galleries that spotlight both Chinese and global artists. And beyond the art, a lively assortment of cafes, boutiques, and design studios awaits, making it a paradise for art aficionados. For those with a penchant for archaeology and the story of human evolution, the Peking Man site at Zucudian beckons. Recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site, it offers a glimpse into the prehistoric era, the remains of the Homo erectus. Famously termed the Peking Man, were unearthed here. This site sheds light on the early chapters of human evolution, and the accompanying museum narrates the tale of these archaeological marvels. Another oasis of calm in Beijing's lively atmosphere is the Confucius Temple, neighbored by the Imperial College Museum. Here, amidst the tranquility, you can immerse yourself in Confucian teachings and delve into China's educational heritage. The temple grounds display stone tablets chronicling scholars from the illustrious eras of the Yuan, Ming, and Qing dynasties. In contrast, the museum celebrates the legacy of ancient Chinese education and its philosophical roots. Concluding our journey, we lead you to Yuanmeng Yuan Park, often referred to as the Old Summer Palace, Though it might not see the same footfall as the Summer Palace, it offers a distinct window into China's history. Originally, this site boasted a lavish ensemble of gardens and palaces, earning the title Garden of Gardens due to its vast repertoire of Chinese and Western architectural wonders. We journey to Changdi, located northeast of Beijing. The star attraction is the Mountain Resort, China's most extensive imperial garden. The resort was built during the Qing Dynasty when emperors escaped the summer heat. Its vast landscape encompasses a palace area, lakes, plains, and hills, perfectly blending natural beauty and historic grandeur. Don't miss the eight outer temples, which are excellent examples of Chinese religious architecture. Tianjin. Next on our list is Tianjin, a major port city southeast of Beijing. Tianjin offers a unique blend of Chinese and European cultures. The city's European-style neighborhoods, particularly the five great avenues, are a testament to its cosmopolitan past. While here, make sure to try the city's famous street food like the savory gubuli steamed buns. The Tianjin Ai, a massive Ferris wheel built over the Hei River, is another must visit for a stunning city view. Pingyao. Lastly, we head to the ancient city of Pingyao a UNESCO World Heritage Site known for its well-preserved city walls. Walking through the city is like stepping back into a bygone era. With its cobbled streets, red lanterns, and traditional courtyard houses, notable attractions include the Raishincheng, considered the first draft bank in China's history, and the impressive city walls offering a panoramic view of the city. Each of these day trips offers a unique experience beyond Beijing's city limits providing a diverse mix of nature, history, and culture. They are a fantastic way to make the most of your time in this fascinating region. Before we say goodbye, we can't let you go without talking about one of the most important aspects of any trip to China, the food. Chinese cuisine is as diverse as its landscape, with unique flavors, ingredients, and cooking techniques that vary from region to region, from sizzling, stir, fries, to succulent dumplings. There's so much to explore. Here are three dishes you absolutely must try on your visit to China. Peking Duck. This iconic dish from Beijing is a culinary delight that truly celebrates the art of Chinese cooking. The duck, chosen for its plumpness, is glazed with a layer of malto syrup and then roasted in a closed or hung oven until its skin achieves a glossy, crispy texture. But the magic doesn't stop there. Peking duck is traditionally sliced in front of the diners by the chef, with each slice containing both skin and meat, ensuring a mix of textures in each bite. It's often served with thin, steamed pancakes, fresh spring onions, 
and sweet bean sauce for a perfect balance of flavors. The process might be lengthy, but the result is a rich, savory, and delicious dish. Xia Long Bio. Next, make sure to try Egg Xia Long Bio. These soup dumplings, or little basket buns, originated from the Jiangyan region, particularly Shanghai and Wuxi, and have since become a favorite across the country and beyond. Xia Long Bio are not your average dumplings. They're meticulously crafted with thin, delicate wrappers enclosing a filling of typical pork and a gelatinized meat broth. When steamed, the broth liquefies, creating a mouth-watering, flavorful soup within each dumpling. What is the technique for eating them? Take a small bite, slurp the soup, and then devour the rest. It's a delightful explosion of warm, savory flavors in every bite and a culinary experience you won't forget. Ma Po Tofu this dish is a classic from Sichuan cuisine, known for its bold flavors and generous use of garlic and chili peppers. Mapo tofu is a fiery mix of tofu cubes and minced meat, usually pork or beef, all coated in a spicy chili and bean base sauce. The ma in its name refers to the numbing sensation of Sichuan peppercorns, a key ingredient in the dish. Add in fermented black beans, garlic, onions, and a generous portion of chili oil and you have a spicy, savory, aromatic, and incredibly satisfying dish. Mapo tofu is usually served over steamed rice, which helps to balance the heat, and it's a must. Try for anyone who loves spicy food. And that's it, your comprehensive guide to Beijing, its hidden gems, and beyond. Whether you're a history buff, a culture, vulture, or just a curious traveler, Beijing promises an unforgettable journey. So, when are you planning your visit to this historic city? Let us know in the comments below. And remember to like, share, and subscribe for more travel guides.